Hello everyone and welcome to MS Opti webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to import MS Office ADMX templates into group policy. For this demo, I have one Windows Server 2019 virtual machine which is domain controller for mylab.local domain. Now the question is why we need to import ADMX template into group policy? The answer is pretty simple one. If you want to manage MS Office in your domain environment using group policy, we need to import MS Office ADMX templates into group policy. Let me show you something. As you can see, already I have opened Saw Manager console. I'm going to click on Tools and then I'm going to click on Group Policy Management as we are going to open Group Policy Management console. Now I'm going to expand Group Policy Objects under my domain. Let's right click on Group Policy Objects. Select new and here I'm going to specify the name MS Office Taste GPU. Let's click on OK button. Let's select newly created GPU. Right click on it and select edit. This is going to open group policy management editor console. Now under user configuration, I'm going to expand policies. Here we have a administrative templates. Now first take your pointer over administrative templates. Here you can see policy definitions, ADMX files retrieved from the local computer. So if you want to manage these settings, we need policy definitions means ADMX files on this local computer. If you want to manage MS Office using group policy, so that time you need administrative template just like those templates. Fine, and those templates are coming from policy definitions means ADMX templates from the local computer. So that's the reason that why we are going to import MS Office ADMX file. Fine, I'm going to close this because later on we are going to check the same thing in this GPU as well. So I'm going to minimize this console and I'm going to minimize the server manager console as well. Now the question is from where we can download or from where we can get those MS Office ADMX templates. So let's go back to our browser. Here you can see already I opened the website from Microsoft. From this website, we can download administrative template files means ADMX or ADML file and Office customization tool for Office 365 Pro Plus, Office 2019 and Office 2016. So to download these templates, simply we need to click on this download button. Now already I have downloaded the set of files. Uh, let's open File Explorer and let me click on Downloads. Here you can see that administrative templates is already downloaded. The link to download this admin template is also given in the description area. So you can directly download this set of files from the given link as well. So now first thing, uh, I'm going to create one folder on desktop. Let's give name, template. Okay, now uh, I'm going to double click on it. Select. Click here to accept the Microsoft Software License Terms and click on Continue. Now it is going to ask that where you want to store these files. I mean simply we are extracting those files. Select Templates which we have created earlier and let's click on OK button. Okay then, files extracted successfully. Let's click on OK button. And I'm going to close this console as well. Let's open Templates. Here you can see we have two folders, admin and admx. We simply need to double click on this admx folder. Now here, as you can see, we have admx files, access, excel, link, office 16, or you can see ppt is also there and word is also there. So these are the definitions files which we need to copy to one particular location. Now I'm going to open file explorer again Let's double click on C drive, Windows folder and here we need to find one folder named policy definitions. So those ADMX files which we were able to see in group policy management console, those are coming from here. If you want to import MS Office ADMX templates, you simply need to copy these files and you need to paste under this policy definitions file. So let's do it. Say it's up to you that which ADMX files you need. For example, if you only need word related settings in administrative templates, so simply you need to copy this ADMX file only. But as we are in a taste environment and definitely we want all those settings in a group policy. So that's why I'm going to copy this all files. 
right click on it and select copy now we simply need to paste under this location c drive windows folder and under policy definition simply we need to right click here i'm going to paste here and then all those files has been copied successfully to follow the definitions folder now the next thing we need those language tags as well so here we are using uh, english united states so i'm going to double click on this folder uh, similar folder will be there under follow the definition file as well so if you don't know which folder we need to open here you can see so here our language is en us let's double click on it and we need to copy this adml files under this folder so let's copy this files and here i'm going to paste those files as well fine then this adml files has been copied successfully so two things are there what we need to copy these admx files and after that we need to open this language folder it depends on you uh, whatever language you have on your computer in my case it is en us and then after copy this adml files to this folder as well fine so these two things we need to do now simply we are done let's close this console this console as well and let's go back to the group policy management console here i'm going to click on refresh button let's select uh, the policy which we have created earlier i'm going to uh, right click on that gpu click on edit now under user configuration uh, i'm going to expand policies and under policies we are again going to expand administrative templates but this time you can see settings are there related to ms office so you can see microsoft access excel office outlook powerpoint word those all the settings are available here this so is simply due to we have successfully imported ms office atmx templates into this local computer now if you want to manage microsoft word 2016 right now all those settings are available here if you want to manage file tab now simply those settings will be there if you click on word options if you click on uh, if we expand it and if you click on customize ribbon here you can see that options is there if you want developer tab on your ribbon that time you need to simply double click on it and you need to select this enable checkbox and then after you need to click on apply okay and then after the developer tab will be there in word ribbon so this is the way how we can import ms office admx files into windows server 2019 group policy that concludes our video demonstration thank you all if you have any question and query related to this video feel free to post in a comment section thank you again